Oh, I love China. It was great. It was, uh, it was one of the most incredible experiences we had. The Chinese view of life is so completely different from ours. It takes a real effort to actually communicate with them, and working with them was one of the most successful relationships we had with any country we worked in. <laughs> okay, that's it. Now, once more. In the yeah. India was my favorite country. It was uh, a very spiritual experience for all of us. Banaras is the great holy city of India. Seeing men bathe in the Ganges, the holy river, was, was truly an amazing experience. One of the most difficult times we had was when we were in Eastern Europe. It was very, very cold last year. The winter was extreme. There was, uh, we lived in conditions where there was very, no heat virtually whatsoever. It was a very, very difficult time. So the sacrifice that the crew made was, was really extraordinary. No complaints. We've had a really wonderful mix of directors from all over the world. They've all been so connected to the episodes they directed. We really tried to find the right director for each script. Most of our, most of our directors have backgrounds in feature films, and that's by design, really. George envisioned each one of these to be like a feature film, only for television. And basically, I think we've given him that. He likes to do his own stuff. Sean takes uh, the time to listen to what's going on, he, and he sticks around and he knows what everybody's doing. You work during the day, uh, you spend an hour or two setting up something that's gonna last for three seconds. You have to focus a lot of creative energy into choreography, really, you know, a little bit at a time. The whole sequence will be made up of little pieces of action, which when cut together, hopefully will flow as one energetic adventure. Sean, we're ready for you, sir. I feel good about any stunt that I do where I'm, where I'm relying on myself. And action! Okay. Okay, cut! Doing the stunts is definitely one of the high points. You know, there's certain scenes in every episode, whether it entails stunts or not, that are just really, really, really exciting. I do research on every episode, you know, so I know, I mean, because each episode is, is a real story, you know, just with, you know, this fictitious character, Indiana Jones, tossed in there, and that helps me to tell the story. Esta es nuestra revolución. Un miserable puño de tierra. Y oyes, vete a tu casa. Te dejo libre. No me quiero ir. Quiero unirme a ustedes. Quiero luchar por la revolución. I think we were extremely lucky to find Sean because he's a 
such a wonderful actor. Sean has such a love of life and enthusiasm and innocence that, that I find that's what he brings to it, I think. But and everybody's just, we're all making a film, we're all part of it, and you know, I mean, that's what's great about it, you know, we just get it done. I guess that's really kind of, the, you know, the formula that makes us work. We spend so much time, you know, on each episode. There's so much energy from each individual, you know, that has to be delivered that, you know, everybody really has to work hand in hand. You just do it, you know. That's how it gets done. What we're shooting now is a lot of bits and pieces. So, um, you know, it's, I can't wait to get back and put it all together and see what it looks like. And it's all been laid out. Rick is extremely good at being, uh, you know, a producer that's on the set and getting the production itself done. I'm primarily an editor. I love post-production. I love editing. That's my main uh, push into the film industry in the first place. I've gravitated toward things I really like to do. You want me to take a look at it and see? Yeah, I think we should look at it right now. because I want to see. And when you know that he's an editor, when you sense that feeling, then working with him becomes like becomes very easy because you're talking to a colleague he knows exactly the problems that an editor goes through the uh, the things that an editor has to do to put a scene together he knows what's going on move in a little bit just the movement will distract you a little bit and you know, make it more active oh, you mean making an actual move in yeah, just a, it's a, oh. a slow movie the Editroid is a computer-based digital editing system and it was developed by Lucasfilm I can experiment as much as I want and save everything it's like a word processor, only for images. I just like all the alternatives I have by working this way. It allows me to spend the bulk of my time in the creative rather than the mechanical mode. Everything should be flowing, it should be a, a flow. And if you have a lot of, uh, of edits, what usually happens is you, you turn up the speed of a scene. That is your Harry. Let's get out of here! <laughs> <laughs>